Greetings, entities and guardians. My name is Hyper Himes, and welcome back to Kick Your Run Oven Break. And I can go ahead and finally go ahead and do this plumbing go ahead story. I don't know why I'm saying and just spamming the word go ahead. But the reason why I say that is because uh, I recorded the video for, uh, by the way, there's that, there's uh, Raid Run, and there's also uh, Guild Runs, which are pretty cool. But also, I, re I basically say finally because like after I made the video of like the cookie trial stuff, you know, with Candy Corn Cookie just recently releasing, I had to go ahead and just take a nap before I woke up again just to record Kingdom. Then when I woke up Oven Break again, when I opened up Oven Break again, not only did I record another video that wasn't the new story, but it was just me getting the new uh, new lobby and showing off Marshmallow Cookie's new costume. But also I did another tiny video which was about the new quiz that they revealed. But ugh, I can finally go ahead and play the new story. Oh, I've been waiting to do this. All right, it's time to grind up for loot. Oh. Beep, beep, you're late. We're getting ready for the pumpkin moon party. The pumpkin moon will rise in this phrase, so let's go. All right, we have... <sighs> just listen to this soundtrack. It's just so dull, but it's like... It's like, you know this place could use some more excitement. But chapter one is heart pounding party prep, and chapter two is the pumpkin moon pie party. So we got to do a lot of party prep. So let's go ahead and start this off. All right. <clears throat> like this, uh, one do. Hello, cookies of healthy hamlets. We have all been invited to the pumpkin moon. Oh my gosh, I almost dropped the mic. I haven't finished my announcement yet. Hey, I said trick or treat. Hi, everyone. I'm Kitty Corn Kiki. I'm sure you all heard about our spooky fun pumpkin moon party. You're all invited, so I hope to see you all there. Oh, she's as spry as ever. I was wondering when she would come around. Uh, the crops are already turning gold, and there's a chill in the air. What should I dress up as this year? How about a spooky ghost? Oh, and the big canos can dress up with us. Look, I made costumes like uh, using big caramel cowboys. So that's why there were holes in the cowboys at home. Mm, how are we supposed to see you in a hole? Does that matter? Are you okay, Cookie? Beep beep. Even the pumpkin moon party is okay with a few little bitty mistakes. <laughs> Did you see the fish? She was she looked like me. <laughs> Myster mysterious things happen on the night the full moon rises as round and bright as the big ripe pumpkin. Spooky hat costumes just add to the mystery. We're so excited. We can't wait. We can get lots of treats and play lots of tricks. Sounds great. I have tons of candy right now, but there's going to be even more tomorrow. There's corn candy, cinnamon candy, even booger flavored candy. Ew, that sounds yucky. Candy corn. The corn candy sounds good, but it'd be nice if there was potato candy, too. I'm going to go head back to my town. I've got to go help set up the rest of the party. You've got it. We'll see you at the Pumpkin Square. The baby uh, potato cookies and I will show you our fair share of candy, too. Here we go, back, back in the basic town. First, I've got to find a big pumpkin to decorate the garden. At night, it can be our jack-o'-lantern. Then, I'll put up colorful lights in all the nearby houses. Oh, and also have scarecrows up, too. Would suit the party, too. <laughs> I'll go to the pumpkin fields first to find a pumpkin. I'll get the biggest pumpkin out of the bunch. Big old pumpkin. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Ooh. Oh, hey, you, could you be over there? You're down by the cornfields. Come out to play. I'll make you into a super cool jack-o'-lantern. What? What's that? Th something that just rolled up and hit on the pumpkin vines. Oh, what does it say? It's a recipe for the ultimate pie, which can only be baked on the night of the pumpkin moon. Oh, lucky me. I found treasure. Oh, perfect for the party. Pumpkin moon pies are supposed to make everyone happy after all. This is a sign for the pumpkin moon that I should prepare for the party all on my own. I can just imagine how happy I'll be sharing a yummy yummy pie with everyone who comes to the party. <laughs> I, I can't wait for tomorrow. I'm gonna write letters to birthday cake cookie and cheesecake cookie. They're the best party hosts, so I'm sure they can help me. Ooh. Party with spooky pumpkins and giant pies? I've never planned anything quite like this before. This sounds like quite a lot of fun. I've truly never seen a party venue quite like this. How about some golden sparkling juice? What's a party without some carbonation? <laughs> whistle. <laughs> they are such a party planner. Beep beep. Oh, that might be like a whistle. <laughs> I think that's what the beep beep is. It's her whistle. We need to do things the uh, pumpkin moon party way. Wait a sec. I might have an idea. What if that was a... Oh, wait. <laughs> wait. I have to do that now. The pumpkin moon party way? I don't have anything like that in my notes. Looks like my research fell a bit short. Candy Corn Cookie, could you tell us more? We'll make this party... We gotta make this a perfect party for you. On our honors, party planners. Mm, okay, okay. Well, on the night of the pumpkin moon, cookies dress up in scary costumes, eat spooky dessert jellies, and drink strawberry jam-colored juice. 
I already got sparkling kick to get drinks ready for the party. And then, oh, everyone gets candy ready. And you can't let yourself be scared by any of the cookies who are dressed up. Uh, who are dressed up. And oh, I have it all written down in a notebook. I'll share it with you. A notebook? Oh, now we're talking. I knew we'd get along. And I think I know what to do for the party now. Let's get decorating. Still no music. It's kind of weird. Maybe, like, it was supposed to be the lobby music that was playing normally, but now it's just not playing for some reason. Mm, I'm curious, Candy Corn Cookie. We may be getting... We may be here getting the party venue ready, but who's gonna bake the pie? Do you know how to bake? Yeah, of course not! Hmm? Then, how do you plan on making the ultimate pie with the recipe you found? Do you think we need to hire a baker? Oh, well, uh, I, I hadn't thought of that far. What should we do? Are there any cookies who can make pies in town? Leave the pie to me. The ultimate pie. The, oh, oh, this. Wait, hold on. Let me just make sure I'm getting this correctly. Okay. I'm sorry. I just had to prepare. Leave the pies to me. The ultimate pie for a pumpkin moon party. That sounds right up my alley. I'm pretty sure that's everything pie cookie. I'm pretty sure it is. Parties are no fun without good food. Let's get coins to make party treats. If you finish all the steps, you can move on to the next stage. We have to get the party ready before our guests arrive. Okay, so now we start running. Is level 5 recommend? Okay, no, level 7 is recommend. F so, fine. I will juice you up to level 7. Juiced. Juiced. And also, I gotta get the treasure leveled up just a teensy tiny bit. So, uh, let's get back to... D d I, oh, I, I wanted to listen to that song more. Anyway. Uh, we got it a few times, I think. Uh, th oh. One more. Okay, we, got to, we can get to level 5. I'm sorry. I just had to spend a few crystals there just so I can get that treasure boosted up, which I even might spend some of my uh, regular treasures, but I just had to get that to level 5 at the very least. Anyway, greatest party thing. We're, and we're not going to skip normal. We're still going to do this fairly. And we're going to crank view to uh, this. By the way, who are, the, gonna be, who are the cookies that we're going to be meeting? Is it the same as like, uh, like birthday cake, cheesecake, and someone else? Everything pie? Uh, who- yeah, okay, we're reading Sparkling, I guess that makes sense. Uh, let me just see. So, Sparkling Wizard and Cannoli? Well, I guess Cannoli kinda makes sense for, you know, uh... I mean, Wizard's gonna get a costume eventually, and Cannoli kinda makes sense because they were part of the 7th anniversary, so... I guess the 8th one should make sense too. I don't know, but let's go ahead. Basically, how, if you're wondering how I try and do these videos, I try and make it so, uh... Whenever I do the main story of, you know, the new updates, uh, I make it so that in the first part, I go through stage- I go through, like, the first cutscene, like, the initial cutscene that we just saw, then we go through stage one. Then, in the next video, we go through stage two and three. And in the next video, which leads to the finale of the actual story, it's stage four and five. Now, here's the thing that I don't understand. As far as my knowledge goes, I think I saw that this update lasts for, like, 20-ish days. And the next update, where, uh, we get everything pie cookie, that's gonna only last for, like, 12. Which I'm just kinda like, you know- it's nice that this update lasts for, like, a while, but why not just make it so that, like, one update lasts, like, you know, two weeks, and the other one lasts, like, two weeks, you know, like, at least, like, more than that, like, because two weeks, that's 14 days, so you combine that both, that's 28, so, like, maybe, like, 16 days for one, 16 days for the other, because, like, come on, like, 20 for one, and 12 for the other, kind of seems a little bit more objective, at the very least, if it was, if it was, like, uh, like, what, okay, 20 and 12, trying to do quick math in my head, you could still split that down the middle by 16 and 16. Even 18... Oh, dang it. Even, like, 18 to uh, 14 seems a little bit more fair. But still, it's just kind of wild. Because they also did this in the last update with an uh, Agent uh, Noodle. Agent Noodle. <laughs> I'm an Agent Jang and Agent Olive. Uh, but anyway, you know what I'm talking about, right? I feel like it's going to be the same format of how this stuff works. Where we're going to most likely need, like, upgrades and stuff. For, like, upgrading, like, how a party works. I need to collect that. Thank you. And, uh, yeah, but, uh... It'll take us a little time getting used to. I think it was just the correct combi. Everything can be set out. And hopefully the story missions aren't going to be so much of a hassle to do. But luckily we do have 13 missions completed already. Which is fine by me. So let's get this all rushed through and sorted. Uh, a sparkling cookie I hope should come up in a little bit. Uh, yeah, our energy stopped. Okay, good, good. Here's sparkling. Hello. Oh, I like this pizza. Candy corn cookie. It's still hours before opening time. What brings you here so early? Your legs must be tired and you must be hungry from waiting. Would you like to come in? Nope, I'm super busy going around town right now. I heard there's lots of cookies coming to your place, so I want to put up posters for the pumpkin moon party. I'd be delighted to add some autumn ambience to my shop. Then can I also decorate with pumpkin lights and ghost stickers? I want everyone to know how fun this party's gonna be. Hmm, why don't we give out candy with every juice order as well? Huh, thanks. Then everyone will get totally what kind of party this is like. It reminds me of when birthday cake cookie and firecracker cookie visited. They were also passionate about throwing the perfect party just like you. 
working hard to make other cookies happy can be challenging, but it's always rewarding. I hope your dedication pays off in a wonderful party. Aw. I really like how that's kind of like a nice shot. No! No! Give me! No. He's right there! I Can you at least like... Give me like a pity thing for that. That's stupid. Anyway, I just want to point out, it is nice how they kind of reference the old story between birthday cake and uh, firecracker because it was the whole like party story about like how one it. Whoa! Okay, okay. That's like, that's like the second most rare one you can get. Have I ever gotten this before? I don't think so. What's in the What's in the thing? I, no, 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 I just want to point out, before I lose my train of thought, it's like, you know, because Firecracker couldn't understand how birthday cake worked, and uh, birthday cake couldn't understand how Firecracker works, so they couldn't really do work, but they realized they can coexist and they can make good parties. So, what is in this thing? 2,000 gems! I am so happy right now. You know what, that makes up for me losing that one pumpkin thing. Anyway, let's collect all these, and I also got a free sparkling cookie and sparkling cookies pet as well. Wow! We only finished the party treat. Looks yummy, but oh wait, this looks like it's gonna be the perfect party. Let's go on to the next stage. So the moment that we collect all these, we can move on to the next stage, but a new cutscene is going to play first, so let's go through this. Still no music, why is there no music? I feel like I should just add my own music at this point, let's be honest. Wow, candy corn cookie. I can't believe you found a recipe for the ultimate pie for the night of the pumpkin moon. Everything, every, everything pie cookie. <laughs> everything, everything, everything. I did hear rumors that you bake pies all day long, but are you actually good at baking? Candy corn. That's, that's kind of rude. I mean, I, I understand your, like, your intentions, but like, you asked everything pie cookie who asks, who, who bakes pies all day long if they're actually good at baking. I can promise you, cookie, the cookies of the candy corn town will swear by the pies. Or, will swear by my pies. Oh. I can promise you that the- wait, is she Irish? If she's Irish, that's so cool. Anyway, I can promise you the cookies of Candy Corn Town will swear by my pies. You'll smell my pies all around whenever I pop them out of the oven. What better way to get them at my own point across than to let you have a taste? I used pumpkins and apples and a bunch of other things sitting around in the fridge yesterday to make a pie. Wanna have a taste? What kind of other things? A anyway, no time to chat. No, no time for that. You can bake, right? You can bet your little cram uh, candy corns on it. Okay. I'll give you the recipe to you. You can make our pumpkin moon pie while we're busy decorating the venue. Leave it to me. I'll whip it, I'll whip this up before you can say pumpkin moon pie five times. Just give it up. I'll just give it a quick whipping up with my whisk and... Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> so, so stop. Hold on. Stop right there. You, you can't just whip up whatever you want. You need to follow the recipe for a pumpkin moon pie. I've got it all memorized. Split open a giant pumpkin, bathe in the moonlight, gather honey made from moonflowers. Isn't... Is the... The recipe really all that important? I mean, I can promise you all the scrumptious pie without one. It, it is. It really is. If you don't follow the recipe, it's, it's not a pumpkin moon pie. We need a special pie for this special party. Well, while I agree with you there, little one, I promise you it's fine to be a little bit more creative than with what... No, no, no. You have to follow the recipe. It's a promise. Okay, okay, sweetheart. I'll think about it. Y'all should just get back instead of the party venue. Man. Well, they were definitely right when they were calling, uh, plumbing <laughs> candy corn cookie a stickler for detail. Let's make the invitations first. Seal it with a bit of sweet sugar wax. Oh, let's use icing to give it eyes. And what do you think of a cotton shade table? Oh, oh, and cover it with a spiderweb tablecloth. Your decoration ideas sound perfect for an old mansion. You know, I bet we could ask Travel Cookie for some advice on that front. We can hang little ghost cookies off the corn stalks out in the fields. I bet cookies will get a big fright if they look up at just the right time. <laughs> and we can also put marshmallow signs to make sure cookies know right away at the party. Or the right way, exactly. Uh, follow the sweet marshmallow trail and you'll find yourself there without fail. What a clever idea. You're so pronounced or prepared for a young cookie. Next stop, decorating the train station. Are we going to the train? Oh, the train! Left, right, left, fall on line. Prepare to march. Marshmallow cookie, are you already here for the party? Can't have a pumpkin moon party without music. I'll be marching along with the cookies in the costume parade. Your sugar guards are looking as sweet as ever. Oh, now I want a candy. <laughs> uh, I'll share us, uh, I'll share with all of you. Thank you, candy corn cookie. The train station is already in festive. I'm already in the party moon, so I better drum my way down to the venue. I'm so glad you like it. <laughs> I'd better get to the post office to send off the last of our invitations. Busy, busy bee. Mm, I could take a few of those off your hands. I'll give them to the cookies. I see on my way to get more. What? 
Excuse? Huh? What happened? What? I think that's the first time ever, specifically in Oven Break, that wasn't on like my phone or anything like that, that the game decided to crash mid cutscene. It has never done that before. And that either scares me, but it also could be because that synthesis update hasn't even been out for 24 hours. I think there's bound to be a few glitches, which honestly kind of makes sense for an update like this, considering how many people were rioting over playing this update coming out. So uh, I apologize for this. Let me just get back on track. I could take a few of those off your hands. I'll give them to the cookies. I see on my way to get more ingredients. A everything pie cookie? What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be making our pie? Mm, I don't have all the ingredients on hand for the recipe, so it looks like I gotta go looking for them. I mean, I'd be all for substituting a few things out myself. That's the dish. All I've got now is this big empty pie pan. If you're feeling a little impatient, I could always just toss a few things in for my fridge. Uh, uh, uh. We, we, we promise no just throwing anything in. Yeah, but there's no stopping you. What, what, what ingredients are you missing? Mm, let's take a little look see. I don't have vegetables soaked in city night lights. Uh, it seems like this fancy pumpkin moon pie needs all different kinds of moonlight. Vegetables soaked in city night lights? Where do you even get something like that? I told you the recipe was a bit unreasonably strict. No, it's not. It's just... What kind of vegetables would we need? Maybe some veggies that spent the night in the city, or I suppose who plants lean towards the city at night? That makes enough sense, but everything pie cookie, I think you need to keep working on the crust if you want this pie done in time for the party. Hmm, I guess I've got, I, 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 I guess I gotta go get the ingredients myself. You go, you're going candy corn cookie? The city is so far away, it's a whole six stops from the train. You've never even left the town on your own. Leave, leave it to me, or I may worry my icing off. I may, I may worry my icing off thinking about you. A uh, bit of a quick bake never hurt any pie. No, I, I can do it. I promise. I even went house to house trick or treating on my own for the last pumpkin moon party. Going into the city, that's something very cookie like me. You can count on me, and I'm in charge of making this party perfect after all. Yeah. So I do apologize for that crash, but luckily you basically missed nothing. It's a good thing I can access the cutscenes easily, but. That's just so weird. It's never happened to me before like that. That's so creepy. Legitimately. Anyway, now we do have access to sparkling, even though we always had access to sparkling. Sparkling, I don't even... Th yeah, they're literally only level 7. I don't even have sparkling cookies magic candy. Oh, sparkling cookie. Mr. Sparkling Cookie, do you have a trial? Let me please check if you have a trial. Do you please? You... Wait, no, wait. That's... The you don't have a try. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, that calls for another video I gotta make at some point. But that'll be at a later point. Before I end this video, I'm gonna do something cheeky. Because uh, in the gotcha, over the costumes, they do have this. But they also have all these. Look how many you got. Two super epics. Two epics. 13 rares. Look at this. I mean, I have both super epics. I, I think I have both those. There's two epics. I don't think I have the... I think I may have the licorice cookie one. I know I don't have the adventure one, but all these rares. Angel cookie, double cookie, sparkling, uh, plum currant cream, pastel meringue, soda, uh, red bean, dinosaur, night, strawberry, princess, zombie, and pirate. So I'm just going to do one cheeky poll here. See if I get anything unique. And if I don't, that'd be... I mean, hey, we're already starting off with strawberry and gingerbread. So I'm just going to do this before I end the video. And, uh, okay, so at the very least, this is an epic. I don't know which epic it'll be. It would be, it would be cool if I got the adventure one. But, uh, honestly, I can go either or. The thing is, even if it was, like, uh, things showing off rares, there's, like, 13 rares that I could potentially get in this. Some might be repeats, some not, but, uh, there's a chance I get something special for us. So let's give this a quick gander. Uh, a rare. It's, it's not one of the costumes. I mean, it is a costume, but it's, like, that's the, uh... Oh, Kitty Punk! That's a strawberry cookie house I don't have. Okay. And that's not even one of the newer ones, too. Okay, that's already a good start. This is the epic one. It's the adventure cookie one. That's perfect. It's Crow Wizard. That's the that's the other epic costume I don't have. I mean, it's, you know, the poison mushroom cookie one. That costume, I think I have? I don't know if I... Wait. <laughs> oh, wait. Poison mushroom was super... Okay, well, this confirms I did have the... I got both... Well, well that, that's also, technically, that's a Halloween costume. But, like, I got both epics in one bowl and also a new rare. So far, I'm like this gotcha a lot more. Wow, okay. Well, anyway, now is a good spot for me to end this video because, uh, there's certainly going to be a lot of costumes to get here. So, anyway, with that being said, if you enjoyed the video, then please be sure to leave a like on it and also share the video with your friends if you enjoy my kick around content. And if you enjoy my content in general, then why not subscribe? And also hit the bell icon to be notified of whatever I do in the future. And also down below in the description, you'll see links to all of my social media, which includes a Twitter post where if it gets 10,000 likes, I can get the kick around YouTube staff for absolutely free. There's a link to my Discord server called the Hype Me Sub, a link to my merchandise where you can buy stuff to represent the channel, and lastly, a link to my Ko fi where for just $1 a month, you can see exclusive content that you wouldn't normally see in this normal YouTube channel. And I think I know what I, I think I know what I might do 
do for a video for sparkling cookie, if you know what I mean. But above all else, I will see you entities and guardians in the next, in the next video. Hail the hype beast.